here to say the most famous words in motorsports from the upcoming Netflix film, The Outlaws, actor and comedian, Adam Devine. Drivers, start your engine! And Noe Elizondo, Toyota's honorary starter, ready to wave the green flag. And we're racing in Sonoma. Great jump right off the bat with Danny Hamlin. Christopher Bell almost got in there with him, taking a spot over Reddick. Off the racetrack here a little bit. Turn four, Gibbs and Truex side by side for four. Let me tell you this. Whoa, Gibbs look really at him fan out here to seven. This is the four into seven that I was talking about. That's the first opportunity, a huge passing zone. Oh, there's an issue for Suarez. He, he didn't get off turn four very good. And then with slow off seven, it looks like it's running again now. So that was on an upshift. See, he was trying to shift in another gear, and that's exactly what he did. He was thinking going second to third across that gate, just exactly like Larry told you in that Xfinity race yesterday. That's what he did all day long. When he pushes that baby forward, she downshifts into first. Last time Denny Hamlin won stage one was Kansas, where he went on to win the race. Hamlin has led more laps today than Toyota led in total on road courses in 2022. Here he comes, crosses the line, and banks 10 championship points, and as Jamie pointed out, that one playoff point for winning the stage. Here he comes, Here Truex comes to the Mike. inside. Hamlin slams the door and then goes wide. Yeah, and so, so perfect move by Truex right there. He had no intentions to get beside Denny Hamlin. He showed him the nose, and the spotters are in a weird position right there. They can't see if he's there or not. So Truex kind of faked him out a little bit. And you see right now, he's going to be in the preferred position because he's going to be in the inside of turn two. Right there. Quarter, bumper, clear, trying to cross you back here. Look at this. Still fighting hard on the outside, Denny Hamlin. This is exactly what I said. You can't afford to give these positions up. Blind rise at the top <laughs> of the hill <laughs> there, turn 3A, and Truex all clear here. to the lead. Well, right after Ross Chastain had pitted from 12th, look on the right of your screen at Zane Smith's pit stop. They roll a tire over to the wall from the right front, and it doesn't get caught. Gets an assist as the car pulls out of the pits. That goes out into a danger zone, caution waves. The key is the next car around here, you're gonna see is Ross Chastain. He was on pit road. Opportunity strikes here for some guys. Finally a caution, Jamie. It's handling about the same as it was before. Balance isn't bad, just need to take care of those rear tires. The 11 and Denny Hamlin getting that fresh tear off, said he's trending loose on the long run. Pretty happy with the 11 car. So it's like Kyle Busch will be the leader from Joey Logano. Yeah, and the 11, you saw the front tire changer have an issue right there. It cost him some spots on pit road. The tire changer went down. And we're back to green. Kyle Busch on the break from Joey Logano, William Byron, and Ross Chastain. You know, Clint, I thought it was interesting that Kyle chose the inside there because I always wanted to be on the on the, where Joey Logano is, being on the inside of the next corner if you could, could race him up the hill. But Kyle got a great restart and was able to get him cleared. Doesn't time his out, then there, that's where you see that contact. Here. You see, you're riding along with Truex. I was going to say, there's a car on your outside. He slipped, locked the tires up. Now there's there's one on your inside. The door. Yes. You see, watch Truex lock up this tire right here. As soon as that tire locks up, you saw the car, it doesn't turn. It'll stop or it'll turn, but it won't do both of them at the same time. Bush across the line. Winner of stage two, Logano, Chastain, Byron, Stenhouse. Then Dillon, Truex, McDowell, Bell, and Harvick. You see Martin trying to get that run off of turn 10, but just not there. But he wants that, that position. Chastain knows that he's got a good car and how aggressive he's being right here. Those tires being gone down there in 11 really opens the door up. You see Truex swoop down to the bottom, hook that bottom, and away he goes. He Truex. Truex, big, another dive bomb, getting into 11. Watch him hook this bottom no hard in the throttle. There he goes. Truex to second. 
You better run and hide, Kurt Busch. Or, excuse me, Kyle Busch. I mean, I do that all the time. It's so easy to do. I just saw Kurt this morning. He is here, by the way. Now in turn 11, he's off and away. He pushed that last barrier over in turn 11 further back. You can use that now more further around the corner to wrap it if you need for exit. That's exactly what I was saying. I saw him do oh, it. Oh, he's going for it right here. There he by himself, 15.2. Clear, clear. I'll tell you what, it looked to me like the eight had a good exit off of four, but from that view, I mean, Kyle had to let him go to come from that far back. So here's Truex, the leader pit. Oh, it's the worst case scenario for the, for the eight or the 34 because he got on pit road before them. Regan? Well, the eight car, Kyle Busch pitting also this time right now. The eight car comes in good for three laps, and then it starts to lose grip as he runs. And the 19 of your leader, Martin Truex, he has been very pleased on the radio the whole time, has not said a word about his car. Martin this Truex the, in fourth, first car on fresh tires. And this is the guy they're all trying to jockey around for position, trying to do something to offset them on strategy. Martin Truex, fastest car here today. And action on pit road. Here comes Chase Elliott and Kevin Harvick. So the lead cycles back to Martin Truex, who pitted at lap 75, five laps ago. 20 laps to go in Sonoma, and we'll shed a small tear for 20 laps to go in the NASCAR on Fox season. 16 races complete. The next 20 will be on NBC and their family of networks. Two weeks from today, June 25th at Nashville, I want to wish them uh, a lot of luck with a lot of great storylines we can hand over to carry through the rest of the season. Whoa, a storyline. Uh, I can't say it. Denny Hamlin spun out on front, on the front stretch. Bad, yes, it is. Unbelievable. Watch the third car in line here. Yeah, he's following along right behind William Byron. Just turned it in too sharp. Nails the inside wall, shoots him right out into the outside. And when he hits this outside wall, that's what broke the toe link with the right rear. I've seen that happen before. Man, it really unraveled out from underneath them. Look at Truex thinking about it. What's he going to do? Still time, still time. We're pitting. All the top 10 and more. There's Come Chase Elliott road. staying out. Well, here's who did not pit. Well, first, here is your race off pit road sponsored by Ram. Truex and Bush, the first one's off. Chris Buescher gets one, so does Logano, Chastain, Larson, and Allmendinger. Chase Elliott stays out, so does Tyler Reddick and Ryan Blaney. Things are heating up in Sonoma. What I want to see, don't let Truex get to that inside. He's already the inside of Reddick. Try to hold them up. Going to try to run and hide. Truex to the inside of Reddick. Truex in got to go mode, and so is Kyle Busch on fresh tires. Two to Trying to hold two, pace uh, cool. with the 19. Yeah, he knows, and what he can do is try to be good where you know Truex going to try to set you up. Unfortunately, it's right hold here. Hold your left. You're just Even. not going to hold Number that guy familiar. off. Truex back Wait, to the lead. Yes. Kyle Busch closes up on the lead duo, but won't get a chance here. He's going to try to stay as tight as he can to Chase Elliott as they enter the turn nine right here. Now they make this turn turn right for turn 10, and he'll probably try to get to the inside of, of Chase in, into 11. I'm telling you, though, this is a great call. Alan Gustafson, that's a great call. He might lose one more spot here, but there's still a big gap right here. This is a game changer. Somebody just shot way out of the screen. There's no better feeling than when you have a car like Truex does. You have a three-second lead. You get to take the white flag lap, Clint, and just savor it and kind of enjoy all of it. Don't have to run it 100%. He'll hear these words. Just bring it home. That's, <laughs> That's right. a good phrase. Through turn 12 and Martin Masters Sonoma. Martin Truex. For Joe Gibbs Racing and Toyota gets his second win of the season. Oh, yeah, brother. Oh, yeah. I told you I was going to line it up. I felt bad for him. Good job, man. <laughs> I felt bad for him. I love him. No, he didn't. <laughs> Clint, I don't know about you, but you win one of these races. It's such a long lap here at Sonoma. You want to do all the burnouts. What you, what you really want is that moment with your team. You know, oh, you like got to that, save a little that, bit. That, I want to do this Yeah, yeah I mean, like, it's that celebration They're you get to have with your whole wall. team. Yeah, yeah, for sure. He's going to burn it down right to them, stop in front of them. No, he just went, he went right by him, Jamie. <laughs> 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 I want to turn around. I'm, I'm coming, coming back. back. <laughs> 
He may get a drive through for excessive burnout. <laughs> Fourth win here. Unbelievable, that guy at this track. When you're hot, you're hot. And <laughs> Martin Truex, boy, he mastered Sonoma today. It's one of those old-fashioned. What Larson say the other day? That's an old-fashioned butt whooping right there. Martin, yesterday in qualifying, you said, I'm having fun. You had that big smile on your face. Second win this year. What's it like to have a car this good with a team that's just connecting the way it is? It's why we do it, Jamie. This is, um, you know, this is why you go through years like we had last year, and you just keep fighting. You never give up on it. You, uh, you always believe in each other. You know, we haven't changed anything on our team other than, you know, parts and pieces, and, um, and it's just uh, through a lot of hard work of a lot of people. So uh, thanks to Coach and everybody, and um, our pit crew has been really working hard. They did a great job today. So it, it takes a total team effort these days as close as everything is with these cars and you got to execute. We were able to do that today.